Hello everyone, Johnny here. Today in this session, we will try to solve a written only numbers in an array. From a given array, it should be able to return only numbers. So for this, let us try to understand the basics of it. In this, let us write some code. For example, I have taken like console.log type of I have written type of 42 console.log type of 42 it will try to return as number type of will try to tell what type of value it is for example is it a boolean number a string or anything so if we can see here line number 12 it is trying to perform in this way number so line number 12 we got number here for example, I have written console.log console.log type of Johnny. If you can see here, then we will get an output like this. We got a string. So type of will try to tell what type of data is stored in a particular variable. Whether it is a number, string, boolean, object, array, whatever it might be, it will try to tell the data type of a particular variable now the question is it should be able to return only numbers in an array it should be able to return only numbers in an array for this I am trying to take a small console.log let me write I am trying to call this I am trying to take a, a small function like numbers only I am trying to take a small functions numbers only in this I am trying to pass an array here I am just trying to pass an array here. Let me pass some string. Let me pass some values like 20. Again Johnny. Again 40. Sorry, 40 is the number here. So let us see. If you Even if you pass, it will not get. So it will assume it as a string. If you keep in single quotations, double quotations or backtick symbols. So I am trying to take an array here, numbers of, that is inside a function, I am trying to pass some argument in this, argument is of array, which has the values, tutorials, 20, journey and 40. Let me call this function now. I am trying to call this function, numbers only, and I am trying to pass a parameter for this. In this, I am trying to use, in the previous uh, examples, we, previous sessions we have discussed about filter and map. So I am trying to take the same example here. Just I am trying to write a written array dot, the parameter which we are trying to pass. So it will have tutorials 20, Johnny and 40. In this, I am trying to write filter method here. Filter will try to check based upon the condition if it matches then it will try to create a new array with those elements with those elements so it will also have some few few arguments like three arguments the index uh, value optional and all these things so here we are just trying to use an arrow function we are trying to pass this as an argument and in this I am trying to check if a type of r equals to equals to number it means we are indirectly checking if it is equal to number each and every value will be passed here like tutorials 20 journey and 40 here so type of array will try to check the value of it first one the tutorials type of tutorials equals to number if it is true it means if it is true it will try to check the value if it is false it will not try to check for example see here when I am trying to take this example let me take uh, for example if I take only equals to operator it will try to check only the values for example if I trying to check triple equals it will try to check the values as well as the data type values as well as the data type for example see here let me take an example of 40 so in this if I want to print this thing if I want to print this thing what I can write I am trying to use a function name here and I am trying to pass this values here and I am trying to use a filter 
where we have taken an arrow function and we are trying to check for each and every argument which we are trying to pass whether it is matching with the value that is equals to number and we are trying to print it so let me print this thing so if you can check the in the console yes yes so we didn't get it so let us uh, put this in the console log log let us put this in the console dot log let me place everything in the console dot log now can you see now yes it is clear let me check now yes we got 20 and 40 can you see for example if I remove this one what we will get yes we got this array elements 20 and 40 so it is trying to check with the values if it is equal to number then it is trying to check so uh, type of error if it is tutorials yes if it is 20 it will be number here it is also a number so both values are equal so it will try to create a new array Johnny it is a string here and it is a number both values are different so it will try to check the 40 here again the 40 so this is how we have done with a basic example like using an arrow function using a filter ES6 notations returning only numbers in an array let us look into the presentation part so we have discussed about returning only the numbers from the array in this we have taken we have learned about type of first initially and next one is filter based upon these two concepts we were able to solve this and we were trying to use equality operator here that is it will try to check both the values are equal that is type of error text that is string equals to number which is false so it will not try to push that element into the array in the created new array so it will try to filter out only those elements which has passed this condition which has passed this condition if you have any queries any doubts you can just drop us a mail or comment below this video thank you